Hi, I'm Sharon Jones of Sharon Jones and the Dab Kings, and you're watching Billboard.com. We're going to present for you a woman that's celebrating the upcoming release of her fourth LP. It's called I Learned the Hard Way. I'm talking about the Soul Dynamo, the one and only Miss Sharon Jones. because we have the new album coming out and it's good publicity and a lot of people are here so we just set up at certain showcases and and just to just say this since we're talking about South by Southwest I got my role in the great debaters with Denzel Washington in that movie because someone saw me at South by Southwest a few years ago before we was yeah you know what it's, it's a vibe of musician vibe and I think with me, when I first came down, I was more excited about it. Right. But now, you know, you look at my age, I'm like 54 years old, you know. I love you. Oi, hey, too much for me, let me stop. But no, even myself, like, <laughs> my downtime, once I finish singing, that's why I like to go to nature, get on a boat, you know, run around, enjoy myself. Oh, the album is called um, I Learned the Hard Way. And for some reason, the only reason I, I think the date was pushed up because we just kept getting a lot of demands. And it maybe I came along after I did um, Saturday Night Live with Michael Bublé. And we just had to push everything up a whole, yeah. Well, we had a, we have a song called I Learned the Hard Way. But um, we had a lot, you know, we had 20 something songs that we had to decide which 12 songs that we're gonna keep on the album. And we figured I Learned the Hard Way covers the whole band. Not only just me, you know, it took me so long, I mean, I started my first album, I was 40, and I'm, I'll be turning 54, doing my fourth, and the guys, how we, you know, as far as a major label, don't understand what we're trying to do, you know, and we, we had to start our own label in order to keep our funk and soul, you know, our idea of what we want to do alive, so. First single on the, on, the, on the new one? I think the first one is the, the game gets old. And everyone says that sounds like a Philadelphia sound. Like, yeah. We know, you know what? The drama wrote that. Homer wrote that. And uh, the game gets old so many times. I've, I've learned the you know, game of love, and it always ends. In, it's like every time in this game of love, you always end up getting hurt. How many times can I lose this game of love, you know? And I like like shooting an arrow without aim, you know. Who knows where to fall? So it's just a game, you know, like love can be a game sometimes. I'm not gonna cry no no You know what? My inspiration is that I've been wanting to do this so long. And my inspiration started like really uh almost 15 years ago when I met these guys and I saw that what they were doing, doing that soul, and that was down my alley. Like me being turned down when I was in my 20s, you know, saying I didn't have the look. You know, that could, I could have taken, oh my head, look. I could have taken that another way and went in a shell and never tried to sing again and go work on nine to five, which I did go take a few nine to fives. But I always felt that God had given me a gift and one day people are gonna set me for my voice. Not to say I'm too short, too fat too black, use them to clear your, um, bleach your skin, you know, and then they had enough tell me, stop, stop telling people your age, start lying about your age, you know, and I, I'm, I'm proud of my age, you know, so. See? 